What's up ladies and genitals? The other day I decided to go out and kind of check out the car scene. Unfortunately I was stuck in the middle of a street takeover. So I decided to take my car and whip it around and well I got a guy stuck in my hood. So what do you do? You shake him off. <laughs> After that, I decided to hop into one of my trucks and, you know, I had some good friends that were cheering me from the side. You gotta have friends like this that will run up to your car and give you a high five. <laughs> Later that night, we decided to go to another street takeover. Yes, I know, I've been going to so many and I've been in a lot of different cars and I sound like a lot of different people. But trust me, all these videos are legit, it's all me. And I saw the skyline and I'm like, yeah, this is gonna be the best donut I've ever seen in my life because, come on, it's a skyline, bro. But this guy probably embarrassed himself so bad, he decided just to take off. I got real tired of all this car scene stuff, so I decided to hop on my mountain bike and this is what we got. So the other day I was in the car with my uncle Fat Dong. And he has a little bit of an anger problem. And unfortunately, someone threw a rock at us while we're driving down the road. And naturally, my uncle Fat Dong decided to flip a U-turn and do this. Missed. Tossed a rock and fucking missed. Goofy ass. Oh, these motherfuckers are gonna cause an accident right here. Oh shit! Oh shit! Holy fuck, he fucking hit his ass hard. No man, I'm gonna fuck him. I hit him a fucking asshole. After bailing out my uncle from jail again, we decided to hit the mountains and just kind of cruise in one of my Corvettes. After the rain cleared away, we decided to take our truck and, you know, take it for a walk. Yeah, you'll kind of see what I'm talking about. Car business is just not for me, man. Like, I've just been destroying cars and bicycles and people's lives. Let me hop on a bike. Oh, fuck. As most of you guys know, I'm kind of clumsy. Like, I'm really bad coordination. Like, if I were to put these glasses on, I'd probably poke myself in the eye. So the other day, our truck caught on fire, and I tried to put it out with a fire extinguisher, and I slipped. And this kind of happened. Underneath, underneath. Right <laughs> oh, oh shit! shit. <laughs> hey, move, 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 move! And most of you guys know I've been, you know, trying to apply for new jobs. I got fired from all my other jobs. Truck driver, delivery guy, instruction worker, but guess what? I found a new job loading nice muscle cars inside trailers. The coolest perk on this job is you get to see pretty cool cars. Like, I mean, check out this BMW. After a long day hard at work, I just wanted to go to another car meet. Just kind of like take the trucks out and just have some fun with friends in the back. Ah, that's how you get rid of friends. <laughs> that's awesome, I never knew that. One of my friends dared me recently to drive really fast, crash into each other. What kind of friends do I have? I don't know, they're all pretty chill. After taking all my friends to the hospital recently, I was just driving home. And you guys know, pedestrians for some reason believe they have the right of way every time. And even they can be jaywalking in the middle of the street, they just believe they have the right of way.
Damn, who put that pole there? You know, it's been a pretty stressful day. And, I, and once again, like, how do I relieve stress? Usually by hitting people. But today, I decided to, you know, take my Camaro out and just like, you know, enjoy the car scene. <laughs> Was that the Mustang's fault or Camaro's fault? That wasn't my fault. I was driving forward and he was whipping it. So I got some bad news. I got fired from that last job for loading that Mustang onto the truck. And kind of wrecked it a little bit. I don't know why you would put some slippery ramps on a car like that. That makes no sense. But I did get hired on to be a pro race car driver. This is actual footage of me racing. Yeah, I think I, think I did pretty well considering the circumstance. Bro, you guys are being so dramatic. That wing will just duct tape right on. The hood will buff right out. The rims are salvageable. Most of the rims, I mean, it's just a race car. It's fine. You guys, just chill. All right, I, I could, I'll do better. If you're a car guy like me, there's one sound that occurs from driving that makes you go, ah. it just hurts. It just, that sound is just like, ah. it just goes to the soul of your body and gives you the chills. Here, turn up the volume real quick. Hey, motherfucker, I said turn it up, huh? Oh my heart, that sound of soda hurt my dick dick. It just tingles down to my huevos. Oh my god, it's not mucho grande anymore. Oh my con que me All right guys, that's all I got for you guys today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary. If you liked it, please leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys like. Which one of those did you guys like? Like button, take a shot for every time I say like. And of course, notification bell on so you guys are notified when I get, when I post new videos for you guys. And ready, bonus video, peace. No, 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 no! Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs>